family, it's dinner time! Smells good! I wonder what it is. Yay! Yeah. What? Meatloaf? That's what we had last night. Supper time! Ugh. Again? What? I made a special dinner tonight! Let me guess. Meatloaf. Nope. Really? Seriously? Is it spaghetti? Please say it's spaghetti. No, better. We're having... Uh... Ah! Hmm. If Dad won't stop with the loaf, then we'll all have to stop him. And I know how. Explain to me how blasting your dad with a freeze ray is going to solve your problem. I'm not going to freeze Dad. I'm going to freeze his meatloaf. It'll take days to thaw out. And in the meantime, we can slip down some spaghetti, dog. Bingo! Johnny's ready for some uh, spaghetti. Test family, it's dinner time. Kids, I have some bad news. There's been a terrible accident and there's no dinner tonight. Oh, no! What happened? <laughs> We're gonna have to skip right through to dessert. This worked better than I planned. Oh, is it ice cream? Chocolate cake, chocolate cake, and ice cream? Close. We're having meatloaf. <laughs> There's got to be some way to get him to give up meatloaf. But he's had so many good times with meatloaf. That's why he loves it so much. Hmm. So if I make him have a bad time with meatloaf, he won't love it anymore, and he'll never make it again. Well, sure. That's negative association. <laughs> Hope you... We sure are! Frank, your loaf day! Meatloaf, meatloaf, meatloaf! Johnny, make it out! You were attempting behavioral modification through Pavlovian conditioning? Johnny made meatloaf go boom. Sure, same thing. But it didn't work. I just want spaghetti. It was a good idea. I think we just need to try something bigger. What is it? Do you really want to know? Because it involves very complicated terminology. Or should I just say science-y stuff? Science-y stuff works. All you have to do is sprinkle a little bit on Dad's meatloaf. And then what happens? Let's just say we're going to be having spaghetti tonight. <laughs> Who could that be? Huh. Nobody there. Very strange. <laughs> Ooh, I can smell it already. <laughs> ah, I'll never make me something. It worked. Spaghetti for everybody. Stop! Oh, come on. I've been waiting months to have spaghetti. Um, apparently his work here isn't done. <laughs> So, girls, when does the get rid of the scary meatloaf monster part of your plan kick in? Um, we may not have thought this one through. I know what to do. Ah! Stop making food, monster! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> so, instead of just eating your dad's meatloaf, you'd rather create giant food monsters that want to eat you. I don't think you understand how much I hate dad's meatloaf. Hello? Meatloaf? Mr. Monster? Ah! We have to figure out a way to stop them! Think! What's the best way to fight back against food? Supercharged, ultra-powered kitchen utensils? Come on, Johnny, this is serious! Actually, we might have something there. Johnny! <laughs> Susan! <laughs> what? I'm sticking with what I know. Get ready, spaghetti. <laughs> oh, I like this fight. <laughs> All right, Meatloaf, we're serving you a plate full of trouble. We just checked your expiration date, and your time is up. Heat up the oven to 350 degrees of taking you down. Hey, nobody said anything about using action movie type lines that are food related. I'm not ready. Oh, look, he has a friend. He's got my whole family. If you think for one second that I'm going to stand by, I brought you into this world. 
one. We forgive you, Meatloaf. And we're sorry we tried to replace you with spaghetti. Wow, not only did Dad's Meatloaf save the day, he's like a superfood. And you didn't believe me when I said Meatloaf is good for you. <sighs> oh, you would not believe the day I had at work today. I'm starving. What's for dinner? We're eating out!